so in desktop we have one directory named suru inside which we have two files file1 and file2 and a directory above go to properties of file1 and the permissions here we can see there are three kind of users one is owner one is group and the third one is others so each have different access to the file or the permission given to them like owner can read and write group can also read and write but others can read only so these are the permissions there are four kind of permissions like read write execute and last one is no permission okay so we can check uh, the same things with this directory also go to permissions see the owner group and other here you have folder access and the file access okay so we can manipulate and play with these permissions from the command line interface which is very easy you know i'm going to show you that one so open the terminal So let's check the current working directory using pwd command. We'll navigate up to Swaro folder through desktop cd desktop then Swaro. So we'll list the files with details ls minus l. Okay. So the blue one is a directory, so it has d as its initials. Others are files, so it is minus at this initial. After do minus, we have nine digits letters. You know, these all are these are the permissions. I'll explain the details about this permission. I've written all those things in a notepad, so we'll bring that one. Okay. So this minus represents a file. D represents a directory. So we can uh, divide this nine digits letters into chunk of three so this three this three and this three this three represents one group you know this first three represents uh, the owner second three represents a group and third three represents the others we represent owner with u owner or user with u we represents group with g and we represents others with o so now we know that this file one has the user has access read and write but it doesn't have access uh, execute permission the group has read write permission but execute permission is not allowed the other set only read only permission so how to manipulate their permissions or how to give or take away permission so the command is ch mode if we want to give other the right permission for other the initial is o giving permission is plus write is w and the file name file name is file one okay so now let's check now see in file one we have given we have added the right permission uh, right permission to the other okay so we can similarly we can do that with uh, directory also so see the user have three permissions read write and execute for directory over here so we, we are going to take out the execute permission from the user what what is the command ch mode change mode from user we, we want to take away take away means minus take away the execute permission x and the directory of file name so here it's okay now let's see the details see we took away the execute permission from the user let's clear the screen so that was using ch mode and all those letters u g o and all the permission also letters w r for read w for write x for execute and dash for no permission there is another way which is more fun and cool than this for write we assign 4 for sorry for read we assign 4 for write we assign 2 read write for execute we assign 1 
for no permission we assign zero now let me let me break down this one for you ch mode 754 and file name 754 the first one is for user second one is for group and third one is for others 7 means 4 plus 2 plus 1 so user have all the permission read write and execute 5 means 4 plus 1 read plus execute group has read for execute permission and others have 4 4 means read permission if I'll give ch mode 777 it means give everyone all the permissions let me show you plus minus l so let us give file to all permission for all user so the command is ch mode 777 to file 2 now let's list see we have given every permission to every user so right now i'll take away every permission from file 2 it means nobody can access file 2 what, what will be the command ch move 000 file 2 and let's list this one see now nobody can access file 2 so this was all about this permission and all those stuffs about